So the trailer in the background is about the announcement of the seasons. We've already done a video on that and our thoughts on that. If you want to go and discuss that, then go and check out the previous video. This video is going to be discussing some of the new things that may be coming in that book. Mainly, of course, the brand new Inquisitor model. Also, we're going to be speaking about the potential of Eldar Corsairs incoming with the Kill Team box. So let's jump in and... Let's get talking. So as these chaps are talking about the new Warzone book, there is a little segment of it where it swooshes across the screen and you get to see the back of it. Now there's some interesting text on the back of it, but the main thing for me is the image. So if we just bring that image up, if we enhance it, if we zoom in, enhance, enhance, sharpen, make the image clearer, we can actually see now a new model that is fighting alongside the Imperium. Now, after a little bit of conversation with you chaps from the video the other day, and also people sending me stuff over on Twitter and everything like that, we've determined that this is a brand new Inquisitor model. Now, a few things that give this away as being the new Inquisitor model, one that on his power pack, on his backpack, just over his head, you can actually see the outline of the Eye of the Inquisition. This is like a symbol, like Space Marines have their symbols on their backpack packs, power packs. He has his on his backpack. The actual pose of him as well, it looks like he's holding like the handle uh, of his horde, like double-handed, and it's like dug into the ground, like the sword in the stone, and he's like, come at me, vile heretics, I will purge you. Now, the biggest thing, the biggest thing for me that gives this away, and it is very, very hard to make out, but if you look on the hip of him, you can just make out a pistol holder for his bolt pistol, his las pistol, whatever he's got. Now, we've already seen this in a rumor image already. The rumor image is now actually in the background of this video. That matches this bolt gun, this pistol holder that is strapped to his waist. So it's all starting to come together to show off that we are going to be getting new models when these Warzone books drop. Now, the more interesting discussion is that what does this mean now for the Inquisition? Are we going to start getting rules now for the Inquisition? A lot of people I've spoke to anyway want to play the Inquisition as its own army. Like, you know, you, you deploy some Inquisitors or an Inquisitor and he has a retinue force that fights alongside of him and they can take on an actual army or should I say agents of the Imperium they would like to take, not like just one Inquisitor versus like 10,000 guys. But um, a lot of people want to play that yes technically you can play it already you can put an, Inqui uh, an inquisitor in like a space marine list but they would like to play where it's just agents of the imperium like the shadowy figures of the imperium all jumping on the battlefield purging the foes of mankind hopefully these books will allow you to do something along the lines of that. So hopefully, fingers crossed, you chaps who want the Inquisition stuff, you'll get your Inquisition stuff in terms of models and rules. And for now, let's move on to the Eldar Corsairs because this is another interesting topic. Now, um, there is some rumors floating around that the Eldar Corsairs are going to be in this new Kill Team box set. Now, what I've heard through the whispers of the warp is that Eldar Corsairs were coming. They were a thing. But in what type of context, I'm not really sure. It's never been linked to Kill Team with me. But thinking about it, I think it actually would be a pretty good way to introduce them via a Kill Team box set. I think this is one of the beautiful things with these quarterly Kill Team boxes is that you can actually add a lot of flavor with them that then you can put in your army, like the Krieg, the Orcs. Um, hopefully we get more plastic Krieg in the future. That's something I've also heard. That's another story for another time. Um, but yeah, if they actually do the Eldar Corsairs, um, I think it could be absolutely fantastic. I think it could be great. And uh, putting it to the Kill Team box could really actually match it. Now, who would they be fighting against? Of course, you need it against Chaos, right? Chaos Cultists, Corn Berserkers would be an absolute dream for me, but I don't think we're going to get anything like that because they're probably going to save that for the World Eater Codex being fully revealed and shown off and everything like that. But something definitely chaos is so chaos you get more love. And um, with chaos going back to Vigilus, it would make sense for the Eldar to get in there to try and stop them because obviously the Eldar don't want chaos taking over. They can handle the Imperium to a certain extent, but with chaos, there is literally no type of sitting down discussing truces or anything because chaos 
just want them. They just want them dead, you know, their souls, Slanesh, all the all the funky things that come of it. So the Eldar are going to be working with the Imperium more than they're going to be working with Chaos on this one. All right, Chaperunios, that's me done for another video. Thank you for coming. Thank you for watching. As always, if you've got any thoughts, feedback, anything like that, post it down below and we can have a nice little chat down there as we always do. See you now. Have a great day and hopefully you have a nice New Year's Eve. Get drunk and party like it's 1999. Okay, see ya. Have a good one and bye-bye.